So welcome along and thank you for tuning in. Um, there you go. And so I'm going to play some chess now in the witching hour. The 12 o'clock to 1 o'clock graveyard shift or whatever we call it. And anyway, I'm going to do that. So here we go. Hope this works because it hasn't been working lately. I'm two and a half half I'm I'm down two and a half half with this player so I've got half a point with this player this player's got two and a half so I'm going to be very careful I'm going to play very conservatively and they are two and so what I'll do I don't know a5 non-committal So I'm trying to concentrate hard on this player because this player's got a two and a half half score against me. So I have to respect my opponent. I do, I think.
I'm a Quincy one. Oh, that's too bad, isn't it? That's chess. Just lost, just lost, just lost, just lost, just lost. Oh dear. Looks like um, Rooster's asleep. Oh dear, it was a good game. Uh, he's now three and a half, half in his favour. So, from Holland, from the Netherlands, my opponent, 2260 or something it was. Oh, well, that's the problem with having a reasonable rating. As you get reasonable opponents usually, especially the first game. I'm not having music on because I'm not allowed to, I find you're not even allowed to have music on. Even if it's YouTube approved and all that, you're not allowed it. So I want to look at maybe taking this, I've got to watch my rook here, uh, but I want to look at opening up this um, third rank to start operations on the king here on g7, uh, but that inhibits me of course because I have to watch out for rookie on a3 from queen attack, uh, it makes all the difference really in the tempo of things. So at this time anything can happen. pieces at the king. Uh, doesn't mean I get anywhere, but I like doing it. Threatening F6, 
the sort. Mm. What do we do with this? How do we get somewhere here? Still threatening F6. Got knight here and knight here. I've also got, well, I have against the queen check. I haven't got anything like that, have I? Oh, it's not too good, but it's not terrible. Dear Watson. Don't know about this move. Oh, I'll just play free and easy. I'm going to take this. control problem. Defend. Mm. Defend the deep end. Oh, I love that. It's not very good. It's a bit sad, really. My opponent was playing well until that. Oh, that's not good. Perhaps self-destructed. Don't know what the point is going on. Uh, bet you most entitled to go on. I've had the e-cut. Yay, he can't. Oh dear. Here's another one I've lost to by this game. I've lost one game to this player. So I'm still going to play the same old stuff. So I don't have to look, especially in three minute chess over that time to look. Okay, four. Might do two. King H1 Taking the knight, f6, then knight e6, f bishop d5, then knight d8, threat queen d5. Oh, that's a, another one. It's just about a problem in itself, isn't it? Oh, I'm going to defend the. Um, I'm taking the knight with the bishop up in this uh, but I didn't this way I'm going to what? what are you going to do? I don't know hmm you 96 he can go knight take, bishop takes d5 
and as I talk about it, I start to lose a thread. So I'm going to go here, I think. I might take that. I feel like the thread. I, th there, there, there. I feel like taking this. I also feel like playing this. And then tell the night to go away later. Oh, I'll do this. Even though he can take this, can't he? He can do this. So I'll just do that. Okay, well, that's fair enough. Now I can't take the knight, but I can go here. So if he goes knight of two check, I just take, I think. And then you can go bishop of two. Okay, knight d6, rook e1 check. So he's doing this. Okay, I'll, I'll take the... I'll take this whole thing because I get the rook and the bishop. If he goes for this, oh, he's done that. Um, hmm. I do now I go here. Material, but I've still got a rock. It's a good player. And I'm not very good at this time of night. Check, mate. One each. Now I'm going to play on the queen side, which is what I'm meant to do, but you know, I don't really care about playing on the queen side because everyone's prepared for that with these sorts of setups. But um, really, it looks like I should be playing on the queen side. Really, doesn't it? 
So I quite enjoy it. Um, planning in three minute chess and uh, certain international master Paul Littlewood said do you plan in three minute chess well something like that he said it's one thing to plan in five minute chess but three minute chess well come on that's a bit rich David uh, it, is, it, is, it is, it is, it is quite, quite right. Right, stop talking. Getting into here and there. What's that going to do? Anything? I'll go Bishop here first. See what he does next move because I don't see what he does next move. Yeah, bishop b4 just looks good, I think. Oh dear, that's a bit of a shame. Good play. Thank you very much for that game. So I lost to someone who's got three and a half half against me now. At the first round at about 12.15am here in New Zealand, Christchurch. The city that rocks. And pretty terrible to see the devastation of Thailand earthquake earlier today. Fewer about six hours, five hours behind us. Number one hundred and second, eh? That was uh, the number of my ghost car when I was a young boy with my older brother used to have a ghost car and he used to believe it because he's a wee bit younger than me uh, but not now because we're very old now and but anyway that was the the number for my car was 102 Yeah, I'm going to lose that. Oh, well, that's all right. Whatever. I don't think it's all right. I don't think it's all right at all. Ah, oh, F4. Yeah, I'll we'll go. We'll do a pre-move. <laughs> we'll do a pre-move, and uh, hopefully New Zealand can do all right here. Uh, but the only hope is is that's a bad bishop. Bad, bad bishop. How do you be a bishop being bad like that? You know, that's really, really bad. Queen b6. Queen b6. I, how did I know? I just, yeah, I sort of sense that move's going to come. So, so it's always good. Oh, yeah, this is not very nice. It's, it's not very nice, is it? It's always good to sort of try to prepare your opponent's move but in this case it's not very nice I just lost I think how do I get out of this do I have any ways to get out of this okay I'll play this and then after Pawn takes, which looks the most likely. Play c4. I've still got this problem here, haven't I? We'll be very careful. So, uh, we get in situations like this and we just get, like, really. Uh, we can take this now, can we? Will I take that? Um, I think I will, Sparky. Bishop's on pre. My queen is on pre. Oh no, my queen. Eric Rosen would say, oh no, my queen. Okay, so we're going to respect that. 
I think I will respect that because it is a queen after all. We got two pieces for it, but it was pretty grotty. And uh, so now what do we do? We play this move. What do we do? Uh, how do we um, fix this? Well, I can't go there, David. That must be something to do with the time. Let's go and do rookie two. Just get a checkmate for it. You never know, I might get a checkmate. <sighs> might get a check. And it's not bad considering I was in the completely last position before. Uh, what's happened now? Sacrifice, haven't I? Yeah. Here he comes. Check. 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 Check, check, how many checks is that? Check. I could have done the check, mate. Didn't do the check, mate. Wow, that was a hard game. Very well played by my opponent. Who was that masked man? That man with the purple hat on. The witchy you now. Uh, 12 o'clock to 1 o'clock. It's almost 1 o'clock now. It's 12.43 here in New Zealand. Oh dear, my dangerous bag again. Haven't you been using your free and lovely... Do 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 Go there. Okay, there she goes. There. Queen there. Push it there. Queen there. What does that do? I wonder how many checks it was. Was it 10 checks or 8 checks or what was it? 7? There's a lot of checks.
Just aim for that king of theirs. Uh, one friend of mine said, they always hate being attacked. Doesn't matter who they are. But someone's they, so whoever they is, does not like being attacked. So here it's very, getting a little bit, a little bit, um, sort of difficult for black, especially, I don't know, am I talking right? I don't know. Um, I'm going to go here, here. It's just like, I don't know, the, the night's doing okay, but it's a sort of a little bit cumbersome, isn't it? Uh, take this, I think. And I'm going to go here, here, oh dear. Okay, well you can't get everything. Now at the moment the rook is not the best piece to take on c4. The knight was. Uh, we'll go check. Another check. Or we go check? Oh no. Boom, 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 check. I like saying check. I get in trouble for saying check when it's not check in chess. I, get, I literally get in trouble with people in New Zealand for when it's not check. Look at this check. Boom. Bang. Gone. Thank you. Next game. So I've got 5 out of 6. If I had 5 out of 6 in any chess tournament, in New Zealand, I'd be very happy to have five out of six in any tournament is really good. But I haven't got six out of six. Six out of six would be even better than five out of six for some reason, but I've only got five out of six, not six out of six. As long as we're not talking six of the best from school days. Like Tom Brown school days. It's almost like that. Back then school was. Check to your pawn, not really. Ding. You can defend it. Take that. Oh, this is old, old analysis, I think. I think we do this as old, old analysis. Well, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to play out here, just. My junior is not allowed to use that word, just. Even if it's adjusting their sets, they're not allowed to use it. Because it's a negative. Negative hyper hypochondriac. Um, do I take it? Uh, or do I just go bishop back here? Just again. H5, H4, H3. Don't know. I think I'll keep it open a little bit. Now we'll throw the rook on this file. I've got this bishop C. What I'm going to do is I'm going to bring this bishop back. So now I've got, because he's got a pawn up, I've got all this open lining material, you see. Got all this open lines. Uh, I'll just go mad on that file, can I? Not really. Oh, that wasn't very good. A minute more. This bishop's a problem. For me too, probably. He 
He's diverting my attention quite well. How does he do that? Eh? How does he actually do that? That well, wow, he's doing really well. Uh, we don't want him to have that. I don't. Anyway. Good player, worth his rating, 2258. Last orders, now I've got 6 out of 7. I'd say, if I had 6 out of 7 in any New Zealand chess tournament, I would be R, uh, unless I'm talking about the C grade. Uh, I've been in that, I've been in the E grade, I've been in the F grade. When I started at the Otago Chess Club a long, 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 long 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 time ago uh, in other words prehistoric almost then i was very old then very young then now i'm very old check two four eleven check now if i offer my opponent to draw do you think they're going to accept it and i'll just get a, a draw with a two four eleven See, a threat was bishop d4 and I'm stuck. Check. Check. This is to the bishop. Check. Rook. He's got three no against me, by the way. Check. To queen. And I'll go here.
Well, they're good, aren't they? He's trying to, he's worked out a, a fortress, hasn't he? Oh, well, I'm just going to do a draw, I think. You do a draw? Okay, here. As I keep trying to play on, a bit tough. Um, king there, and then he's got king there. And I've got, he's got, uh, he's got a better position actually. Okay, he wants to draw. <laughs> yeah, why did I do that for? Right. Quite right. Oh dear. Bit of a shame, isn't it? Oh well, he's a good player. Oh, just lost this. <laughs> oh, I've just lost it. Oh well. He's given me a draw and I just went for the win. Oh well, tough luck. So what goes at this? Oh, this is pretty nice for him. There you go. Oh well. And the tournament's over too. Did I lose that for the tournament? So did I get did I get six out of seven or did I get six out of eight? We'll find out right now. Oh, I didn't lose that for the tournament, but I did I was doing alright. I could have got a draw, but I got careless. That's what happens at one o'clock in the morning. <laughs> oh, it's not one o'clock. Oh, I better keep playing then. I'll do a puzzle storm quickly. Puzzle storm. Puzzle storm. These are really good for your chest, by the way. Check. 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 Mate. Uh, bishop there. Dunk. <coughs> Check what takes the um I can't do that. Right, we'll do this check and mate. Is it check and take take ye all of it? Queen check. Queen takes. Queen here, queen takes. Rook takes. Um Queen takes. Rook here. Um Queen check, mates. Uh, knight takes. Knight takes. Uh, where's checkmate? There's checkmate there. No, we'll take the queen. Um, that's the sort of chess I had to play with that guy. But I didn't do it, did I? I lost. That's the sort of chess I should have played with him. Check. Uh, rook there. Queen takes. Uh, oh, what's this one? Don't be getting too keen. Okay. Duh. Discovery check. Queen takes. Rook takes. Um. Bishop check, queen mates, uh, rook check, rook takes, a6, a7, knight e7 check, knight takes, queen takes, uh, check, check, uh, oh dear, David. Knight takes, rook takes, there goes that. I'll go here then, queen c8, 
Want to see eight. Knight uh, d five. Rook a eight. Uh, rook d eight. Bishop c four. Bishop there. Queen there. Queen takes. Um, no, 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 no. G4, da, da, da. Rook f6. Rook e4, mate. Uh, rook d7. b7. Rook b7. Um, knight e6. Bishop e6. Bishop c8. Uh, two. What's this one? What's this? this? Okay, it is. It's that move. It was that move. Rook e6. Queen e6. Oh, no, it's not. It's this and that. This is queen check. And this is e4. Missing something. I was missing something. I was missing something. <clears throat> oh, by now I can play a little bit more, and then I'm finishing. Uh, puzzle storms are very good for your chess and some puzzles, just puzzles and problems, chess problems and two movers. Even though they seem, I'll never get that position ever in a game of chess. Excuse me. I lost that game. Oh well. I've been a, a good player the other day. My best one so far, which only happens every so often. 26, 50 or 60 or something. Rated 26, 60 or whatever. And I don't think my opponent went berserk mode, so we were, it was three minute chess. So it's quite good. So you gotta take always the good with the bad and the ugly. Just gonna do it. You don't have to do it, but uh, I have seen some players, uh, I can do that too, but pack a real big sad as if, uh, I don't know, it's probably the way it is, but I've seen grandmasters carry on like, uh, they lose and they just, they act like they're about six years old. Or, although that might be an insult to six year olds because I don't think I even see six year olds act that way sometimes. Especially if you get violent. I'm not going to drop any names though. Because we all, we all do those sorts of things, don't we? Really, if you want to participate What's your favourite thing about chess? So if you want to comment, what's your favourite thing in chess? And also you might want to say what your yeah, thing that you dread most in chess and that you least like in chess, what that is. I asked my junior that. I asked him, what do you like most about chess? And the answer came back, attacking. That's quite good. And then the other answer to the other question was, what do you least like? Was king and pawn in games. Okay, so guess what? I study with them. I study king and pawn in games. And I get to learn them too. That's a real bonus, isn't it? It's a real bonus. So what did I do? And every time we have a session on Saturday afternoons, or evening, or whatever you want to call it, or at some places it's Friday night, or Friday afternoon still, what did I say to, what did I say to him upon, um, 
every time that we see each other over on Zoom, I say, oh, guess what we're going to do? I don't want to ask, he says. Take that. As night check here is quite good. If the, the night is taken. It wastes my time a little bit because I was just going to go Queen G5. And then threaten knight f3. Um, can I take that and go knight f3 and hit the queen and then go queen there? This is the whole thing about puzzles, you see. Is this sort of thing. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to be safe. Then sorry. The old cliche old cliche so when I uh, every time I coach him he's uh, he's 50 years younger than me he's 50 years younger than me that's old for me I'm old and uh, he um, dreads it that and I said to him I want to make I want to make King and Pawn in Games, your best friend in the whole world. That's my intention, is to make King and Pawn in Games your best friend. And then I can be a good coach. If I don't do that, then I'm not a good coach. Then I'm just a mediocre one, you know? And so it's way better to um, operate that way I think a lot of people when they coach they coach um, this is how you move a pawn I don't do that I believe in chucking everybody in the deep end and I mean the deep end it's the only way to learn it's the best way to learn and that's what I think Now if knight f4, rook f4, e f4, knight f3 check, forcing pawn takes, bishop takes, and queen g2 is checkmate. So I've got a book here that I've had for a long, long time. It's, uh, forgive me if I say his name wrong, it's, what is it called now? Um, tactics but um what is it called now? winning chess combination sorry from Hans Bolmester from Holland or from the Netherlands as it's called so we do this as promised and we do this check which is a royal knight fork and if that then we take this and then it's checkmate next move so we do this and I've only got and I've only got this and my opponent's resigned. My opponent beat me last time, so it's one all. So well done to my opponent. So that's probably why I took my opponent seriously. <clears throat> but the the best way to any time that you say something like it, say for instance you say you don't like rock and pawn in games, well guess what? I'll join you because I don't like rock and pawn in games either. Uh, but the best thing to do is to, you know, face that fear kind of thing and actually do rock and pawn in games so that you make it your friend. And it's way better to be friends with king and pawn and rook and pawn in games than it is to be saying, I'm going to avoid them because guess what? Your opponent's going to do the same. Your opponent's going to do the opposite, I mean. Your opponent will do the opposite of what you fear. They will go for it. They'll say, oh yeah, David doesn't like King and Pawn in game, so guess what I'm going to do? Duh, it's obvious, isn't it? I'm going to do a King and Pawn in game. I'm going to steer the game towards a King and Pawn in game. So what you do then is you make sure that when they do that, ha ha, you can say to yourself, ha ha ha, 
that I've fallen into my little wee trap. It is a very small trap, but it's possible to fall into it. Isn't it? You just got rid of my bad bishop. So it's so important to know the end game because the end game is part of the game of chess. If you know the end game, then, then, oh, I can't play that because I'll get g5. So I'm going to forget that what I was going to do because that would have been pretty serious for me against me it would have been g5 not doing very well with regards to other things on the chessboard he's got the sweat later on see of this knight here um Now it's my opponents threatening me with these things. It's not very nice. So it's, it's quite sort of, like it's sort of quite cramped over here. But this is where my king is. So I'm going to have to be very careful. And uh, I'm, I'm just like wanting to pluck away at these pawns of black. Now I threaten knight e7 myself. Knight g6 end of game. And I'm just going to come back here. And this really annoys me, this sort of chess. As when I'm black, this chess annoys me because I'm sitting there going, oh no. You know, like, um, he's just picking up my pawns and not really doing anything. Because I'm not really doing anything, am I? Um, it really annoys me, this sort of chess. When my opponent plays it, just methodically playing moves that are just improving their position but they're not really doing anything they're playing like magnus so i'm not saying i play like magnus of course not who can no one can play like magnus there's no one in the whole world that can play like magnus no one can oh my cl my cloak my cloak my cloak Now I can contest with moves like queen e2 if I want. Don't want to go rook. I don't want to go queen g3. Here he comes. I'll just go back here again. And oh yeah, look at that. See? Just have to wait sometimes for your opponent to make the mistake that you want them to make when you're a school kid. You just have to play like you're a school kid sometimes. Not that I'm going to necessarily play this right. So at the moment we get we might get a queen swap here, Dave. If I can get a rook check, then that's not too bad, is it? I mean, I'm not sure if I'd be marching my king up here, but good on him. He's marching his king up here and. So I'm not sure if it's a good idea because I don't know this move looks like I'm going to get this b-pawn at least. Oh dear, checkmate. Is this checkmate? It was checkmate at 1.15am in New Zealand. It's 1.15. The whole country is 1.15. It's not like Australia where you've got about five different time zones. Especially if you're on the west coast, Perth and that sort of thing. Perth has no daylight saving. So they are sometimes six hours behind us. Imagine that. And uh, it gets dark really quickly over, the, over there in Australia, especially that time of year. 
which is coming up soon for New Zealand. We're putting our, we're putting our clocks back, so that means oh, I get an extra hour of sleep. But also, oh no, 25.02. Right, better concentrate. This is the French defence worth F5. It's actually quite good. Uh, it's made up by me. But it's not the it's not the first time ever because it's in an old old book that says uh, F6 or F5. You see, so it's not made by me, but it's not bad. It's all right, especially if you've got a strong opponent like this. They're going to take this very um, casually. My opponent is, of course, very good. Uh, bomb. I'm not scared of knight d6. I'm not scared of um, double ups and that sort of thing. Uh, but here, what do we have? A pawn win here. Uh, can we win a pawn with knight takes here after knight e3? Knight takes here. And pawn takes, queen takes. It's a bit greedy, but guess what? Ah, oh, I think it's a little bit. I think it's a wee bit sort of. I don't think it's very good. Oh, my opponent's in uh, berserk mode, twenty-five zero two. My opponent is in berserk mode, so I probably should. Um, play a bit more carefully than I did last time. I had this sort of opponent. Still the same stuff over there, isn't it? Okay, so what's he doing over here? See, fair enough, but they don't know who I am. Uh, I'm going to take this, I think. Just because I better. Don't know what's going to happen next. Check to your queen. Check to your rook. Knight. <gasps> oh, that's right. He's got that, isn't he? Play differently, better, don't they?
your resigns. Wow, 25-02. Oh, you resigned. That makes up for the other game that I had similar rated player. Well, that wasn't, I didn't play too bad actually. Um, I'm going to want to connect the defense of this pawn, but there was a time that I thought, no, I don't want to do an unlimited, sorry. Thank you. I don't want to do unlimited. I've never done that. Unlimited. That'd be interesting. That's like a correspondence game, isn't it? How are you looking over there? Are you looking okay? I just beat a big player. That's a big wick for me. That is when I'm 21, 50, 22, I can get up to 22, four for rapid on 2300. But for me to beat a 2500 is pretty darn good. Pretty happy with that. Okay, pretty knobbly looking at that. Pretty knobbly looking move. I wonder when he checks that word before. Oh, yes, I'll get going soon. I won't be too long. You go to bed. I've got to get. Oh, I've got to go to um, someone tomorrow.
So it's always good to see your mountain that you, that you don't want to run over or climb or something like that. It's always best to look at it a different way, especially if you can start to conquer it. Then you can, uh, then you can face it when it comes to you and say, hello, my friend. So if you've got that situation, it's the same in chess. Uh, I mean, I used to, just not too long ago, uh, not worry about my bad bishop. And I'd make a, a real bad bishop for myself. Uh, what do I do here? I'll go here, whatever. It doesn't really matter. It's just fun. Play number 11 though. Now threaten this, of course. And we'll go here. So this is all nonsense, really. Someone said to me, um, This is absolute rubbish. How come I'm having so much trouble with it? Now if f6, okay, right. Well f6 isn't isn't too bad, but that's not bad either. We'll tuck this away, eh? Threaten this. Cat Morphe. Cat weasel. I was a kid we grew up with cat weasel. <clears throat> um, yeah, so I've got this sort of like what we could call a bad bishop. But um it's got it's got advantages too really, isn't it? There's what I'm waiting for. That's what I'm waiting for. So, that was nice of him. Uh, so, it's good to try to play somewhat positionally, even though we're playing lightning chess. Still good to play positionally. So we've got this square here to watch out for. So we have to respect. So do we just go for this? I think so. I think we go for this, don't we? Now we threaten checkmate because we've got a support for the the um got a support for that square there, haven't we? So is there any particular, to the viewers, is there any particular game, part of the game that you most dislike in chess or do you not want to say? Do you want to just tell me the good things that you like about chess, which are very easy to say, which are things like um, attack. And some people I know like to defend all the game and they like to grovel and they like to snap a pawn up and then hang on to it till the almighty end. And so that's their style. They like that. And uh, they're just like that, that old toy that kids would have in my era um, of something coming out. A coin would be grabbed. Not sure what it was now. A coin would be grabbed. Um, 
on and it would snap it up snap it up the coin would be snapped up It's a bit like that. He would play, he plays chess like that. He just grabs a pawn, puts it in his, like William Hartston would say, puts it in his coffee cup. Thank you. Puts it in his coffee cup. See a pawn, pick it up, put it in your coffee cup, is what it says. Thank you for that um, lovely morsel you just gave me. Now yeah, I'll go here. I oh, know I'm through. Um, allowing uh, knight d5. I'll go here. I'll go here. Uh, go here. And go here. Go here. Okay, right. We'll take that. Uh, what do we do next? They're very popular. If I put them on my chess channel, they are very popular. The amount of checks I've got. Thank you. The one I, I was looking, then I saw it. What did I see? Checkmate! Oh dear, I didn't even see it. That's how bad I am at this time. What time is it now? 1.37 a.m. Coming third now. I'm just about going to go. And now I'm playing number two. Who's got one win against me already? Uh, what's that one? Doesn't look very good. I'm checkmated I'm a bishop down there now he's number two because he also to be fair he's gone berserk mode
So with, um, to the viewer that's watching, with this sort of thing that's going on with the rooks, you wait till they actually move the rook and then take the other one. But sometimes you have to watch out for little wee tricks. So here I'm just playing B5 of course and we still now white is threatened with uh, pawn. I'm going to probably take the rook now. I'll take this one. Um, even though it sounds a bit topsy turvy, I'm going to do that that way. So we still got the knight there. This knight is holding the fort for. E6 pawn. So this is, if I can open this up, he might be going to play E5. If he plays E5, I play Queen C8. So now I'm going to play rook here with the idea of rook c8 check. If he tries to win this, then it's usually not a good idea. Uh, I'll go here. Check me. Right, I'm out of here. Um, where am I coming? Oh, first. Oh no, I better go. Keep going. Better, I'll probably go up to chest to keep going. Gonna be at the uh, medical centre for the car at what time do I have to be there? Ten o'clock.
doesn't matter anyway. I had a wee cup this afternoon. So I can do a bit of this. Mm-hmm. Get a wee bit tired. That's a good move, isn't it? Yeah, I think so. I'll take this. Oh, we might be on TV. For what it's worth.
I'm meant to be here only till one o'clock. <laughs> I'm meant to get some shut eye. And as I have to be at the, I have to get the new sticker for my um, car or decal or decal on my car for the chest channel that I've got. And uh, because it's um, actually under New Zealand Consumer Guarantees Act, um, let's check if King Up then Rock takes Pawn. Check. And night check. Okay, so, but I've actually, I've, I've sort of got to go, but because I'm coming in the first spot, I'm extending this. I was only going to play about two games in this part of this tournament, but I've got a big wig before. But anyway, they're, they're going to um, fix my whole sticker that I got put on there about a year ago and because of the New Zealand Consumer Guarantees Act uh, I said to him I'm quite happy it was pinning it's pinning away my sticker for my chest channel and I'm actually going to be able to change it to better wording because it used to say something like um, David Wiganar chest channel and that's it and then they say well yeah well who's actually um okay i'll take this i think this time Um, yeah, anyway, stop laughing, I'm too tired to laugh.
that was hard. He's a very good player too. Oh, I've come sick. Second, oh well, because of the draw. Well, I, you know, or second or third or fourth or whatever it was. But that was a hard game. Oh well, thank you very much. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Thanks for putting up with me at this time of night for New Zealand. It's now 1.57, it's now 2 a.m. shortly. On a Thursday, Thursday, what day is it? The 4th, the 4th. Okay, thank you very much. I appreciate that, and not too bad. Again, second, uh, I'll see. Am I second? Yeah, I'm second. What's my performance is 2444. That's my highlight, is 2502. Bye for now.